Lucy double ended in properness? What am I talking about? I'm talking about this. Whoa! Two violations of the fundamental theorem of calculus, so we need to fix it into two different situations. But first, we need to fix it into two different integrals, and here we go. We're gonna pick a nice point in this domain. Maybe zero, why? Because it's the killer, and it's gonna be a nice point. So, we're gonna go and we're gonna break it up into zero to infinity, x to the third, e to the minus x to the fourth, dx, and then we're gonna add that to, wait for it, minus infinity up to zero, x to the third, e to the minus x to the fourth, dx. Church, those two are equivalent. Now what? We're gonna break this up into a one-sided, and we're gonna break this up into a one-sided since I'm over here. Let's go ahead and let's do that now. Let's go ahead and let's just say that this is s. Yes, to zero, whoa, 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 x to the third, e to the minus, x to the fourth, dx, then what's next? We need to put a limit in there so that it's equivalent to this, so it's the limit as s goes to minus infinity, and what are we going to add that to? Whoa, let's break this one up, just like we broke that one up. All right, so then... This is, whoa, let's just call it T. Oh, I think they like T. Oh, I think they like T. It's from the dirty, dirty south. You're probably not gonna get it. This is the third, e to the minus x to the fourth, dx. And we also need to put a limit on this. Limit as t goes to infinity. So now, since we're here, let's work that integral. So I'll write on up here. I'm gonna write an equivalent. Well, without making substitutions. Let's call this, let's call this the integral of x to the third e to the minus x to the fourth dx. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna sub those limits back in there later. Now, I'm gonna integrate this. You are minus x to the fourth. Then du is minus four x to the third. We see, we see, dx. Boom. So we're going to replace these guys, x and dx, with this piece. But to make it a little bit more clear, du over minus 4 is x to the third. dx, what comes next? Our substitutions. We see that guy, whoa, 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 is du over 4. So then I'm going to write minus 1 fourth outside the integral of all right, that's du. This piece taken care of, the x to the third dx, bam. So then we have e to the u, because minus x to the fourth is u. All right, so then we integrate that, and we have minus one fourth e to the u, u, and we can plug that back up over here. So we're gonna be looking at the limit as t goes to infinity of minus one fourth e to the, what was you? You were minus x to the fourth. Minus x to the fourth, and then what? We're gonna evaluate that from zero to t. And we're gonna add that to, it's getting hot in here. Let's uh, take off this integral, because that one will finish later. Okay, so I'm going to go and I'm going to do that same dang thing in blue. You're my boy, blue. So then I'm going to go and I'm going to rewrite that integral. Boom. The integral, x to the third, e to the minus x to the fourth, dx. And I'm going to let u be a minus x to the fourth Does it look like I choked out a Smurf? So then I'm back here. Then du is equal to uh, 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 minus four dx. Boom. Derivative. 
Boom. Subtract one. Oh. Damn. Smurf! So Dan, this is a uh, D U over minus four X to the third D X. So now we found our pieces. We go and we make that substitution. It's a uh, minus one fourth the integral of E to the U D U, which integrates to a minus one fourth e to the u. So now let's go and let's throw that back over her. So then we're looking for the limit as s goes to minus infinity of minus one fourth e to the, what was my u? A minus x to the fourth was my u. And then I'm gonna evaluate it from zero to s yes now i'm running out of board space but i'm looking at this and i could evaluate it at those limits then take the limit then take the limit and then what look at a graph of this thing no come on come on get in here get in here I didn't actually graph it ahead of time. I'm just doing this because I'm out of room. And I'm looking at that, that's odd. Meaning I'm gonna have some symmetry. And then that's even, but more over. This is gonna overtake that one and crush this whole thing to zero. So what? It's gonna look something like... Mm, and if we're looking at infinities, isn't, come on, get down here. This area, negative, and that area, positive, and those areas are the same by symmetry. All of this is gonna equal zero. Ha <laughs> ha, sucker. Sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.